a, a, somebody just showed up out of nowhere. Hey, I need to see him. The last episode of Gang and Rumpa 2. What's good, y'all? Welcome back a to another freaking last video of a series. A lot of people say I don't finish series. A lot of people say I take forever. It don't matter. We're here. Let's get it going. Uh, are you Junko Enoshima? Did you say Junko Enoshima? Isn't she dead? Yeah, bro. It's true. I did end up dying the last time. Uh, I'm sorry, okay? I didn't mean to go so fast. I... I couldn't help it, you know? It was my first time. First time dying? Bro. Jeez, stupid. You're the one who made me go. And why is someone who died here right now? Do you guys know about an artificial intelligence called Alter Ego? That's my guy. Exuberance. We are now an AI. We have transcended humanity. Right, right, right. What AI? Stop saying all this crazy bullshit. You see, my personality is like this because I'm the type who dies easily, right? That's why I made my own AI program while I was still alive. Don't y'all worry about me, bro. I know the, the face cam goes in and out because of this last trial. I'm literally just tuned into the, to the episode with you. We're just watching together, bro. So you'll see me occasionally throughout the video. I might be eating, I might be drinking a Bev, bro. It doesn't matter, bro, but I'm still, I'm engaged. And then someone uploaded me into this Neo World program. And that's how Alter Ego Junko hopelessly appeared in front of you guys. Interesting. That's insane. This insane bitch is. <laughs> uh, Haji said the B word. She's responsible for everything. The destruction of Hope's Peak Academy. The destruction of the world. The one who took over the Neo World program and forced us to kill each other. It was all this B word's doing. Even so, what am I supposed to do? Even if we know she's Junko Inoshima. Don't get cautious and think stuff like, what can we do? I mean, we're all ultimate despair here. Each and every one of our classmates looked at us like we're a bunch of loogies on the side of the road. So, let's all be friends! <laughs> Hell no! Man, they hate me. And I was thinking of you guys when I tampered with the graduation program. But they still hate me. Huh? Tampered? With the graduation program? Remember what that fake Makoto said earlier? About what happens to you when you graduate, right? Right, right. Show, show the, can you show the image one more time, please? I feel like you guys weren't getting a big enough reward for graduating. So, I decided to modify what happens so it's something exciting and unique. Just like a game. Who are you finna call? Here we go. Uploading your game memories into your real bodies is fine, but letting your friends stay dead just sucks. That's why I decided to resurrect them. This is the new graduation program I'm offering. Resurrect? Hey, are, are you serious? Can you really do that? It was like real hard, you know? The graduation program is the core part of this game, so it was protected with a lot of encrypted codes. It took me a long time. I felt so much despair about how useless I am. Bro, did we already talk about how nasty this voice is, this character is, bro? I'm pretty sure that's Teru Teru, bro. Country ass. Well, one advantage of being an AI is that I got smarter with computers. Before that, every time a computer froze, I used to put it in the microwave and nuke it. Me too! Show of hands, class. How long do you think it took for me to modify it? Who cares about that? Are you serious when you say that everyone who died will come back to life? Did you forget? You gotta answer questions to progress the story. That's the rule of this game, right? By the way, I'll give you a clue. 
You guys were always watching time slip away at a certain place. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. So you're not gonna tell us until we answer that? We're completely at our mercy. But if we can't progress unless we answer, we have no choice but to answer. How long it took for Junko and Oshima to modify the graduation program? It was that big ass clock in the middle of uh, uh, of the park. Uh, perfect. I see. The countdown at Jabberwock Park. That's the only place we can think of. Facts. Great guess. That's the only place we consistently watch that has anything to do with time. Then that countdown represented the time that was needed to modify the program. Mm, okay. How brilliantly wrong! <laughs> You're totally wrong about that tricky timer. Wrong? Then what was it? How should I put this? I was just goofing around. You built a whole time bomb just a goof? Huh? I mean, isn't stuff you don't understand exciting even though you don't get it? It's kind of like superhero cosplayers or someone else's designs of alien life and stuff, right? It, it was just for show? In the end, it was meaningless. Does that fill you with despair? Like getting booted from a game server? You know those murder mysteries where the culprit is really the detective who's investigating the murder? Well, I'm so over-predictable crap like that. Just what did you expect at this stage of the game? She's... she's seriously messed up. Well, in a way, the countdown implied I was on a mission. Did you ever make up your own silly rules, like don't step off the white line when you cross the road? I was testing myself to see if I could get you guys into the graduation program before the timer reached zero. Oh, brother. Enough. Please stop. Right. Thank you, Sonya. Don't be so disappointed. It's totally true. I had a hard time manipulating the program. While you guys were at the beach making wrinkly dog faces, I was working so hard on my own, you know? Hey, enough with this pointless crap! Are you seriously going to resurrect everyone who died? Like I said, it's easy. Hmm, it's just a game after all. Just a game. Why does that feel like I'm like important? Yeah, each and everything that happened in this world was just an event within the game. Hmm. There's no way anything that occurred in the game could affect the real world. Hmm. What you're saying now is completely different from what you said right. before. You said whether or not it's a lie. The moment you feel something is real, it becomes real. The game where you throw my words back at me is over. So you don't really have to worry about it. Fine. I won't worry about it. Hey! Yo, Fuyuhiko, if you don't... You don't stand up tall, bro. What are you talking about? Who fucking cares about logic? As long as everyone who died comes back to life, that's good enough. Okay, I'd rather you be like that than cry and tell about, you know, I give up already. But if we do not understand the principles behind it, then we do not even know if it is really possible. I feel you in there. I feel you. My fault, my fault, my fault. I feel you. True, 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 true. Anything goes in this world. You've seen that happen so many times already, right? Well, if a high school girl can get huge, and it's not crazy if the dead can come back to life, right? Why does Spike have this high school girl talk about her breasts like that last episode? Like, Makan laid out salad toss? Like, come on, dude. Why well, Spike is a weird one. If she's saying that's how she tampered with a computer program, how are we supposed to respond to that? That's right. That's why you should finish this game and go back to living a normal life in the real world. Okay, like, like I don't want to do that. If we go back, what do you get out of it? Hmm. What, what do you get out of it? By making us return to the real world. As long as we don't know what it is. Man, that's so annoying. You're so petty. It's not like you're a housewife living on a tight budget. What are you talking about? All I want is to put on this graduation performance in a more dramatic way. Hold on, y'all. Does this mean that Monokuma is just well, Jungo? if you doubt me, you don't have to go back. Is that what you want? Not to go back? You know that's oh, not what I want. Hold on a sec. 
we're obviously going to get out of here. If it'll bring our dead friends back, it's all we can do. Nigga, they barely of like course. you. We've been working toward that goal for like forever. Because we had that goal, we were able to endure those killings. Whose voice was that? Why you sound all cool? Everyone can go back together. So there's no reason to hesitate. Yeah, you are right. There is no way we can choose to stay here after all we've been hold through. Hold on, hold on. Hey, hey, hold on. Uh, how did you say expected something? from the winners of this killing school trip, your will to live is truly ultimate. Howdy, I need you to say something, bro. <laughs> That's just more reason for you to execute your role as devices. Devices? What are you talking okay, about? Okay, now let's stop stalling for time with exposition and hurry up and do it. The game literally just said that they be stalling with BS dialogue, bro. I don't want to hear y'all talk about... Y'all know what I'm talking about, bro. Well then, why don't you guys just go ahead and answer with the touch panel that's in front of you? Something about this is fishy. Why is she helping us, I'm bro? I'm gonna do it. I'm seriously gonna do it. If you don't hurry up, I'm seriously really gonna do it. Do what, bro? You don't have to say, who are you talking to? It doesn't concern a chump like you, Hajime. What? Ch chump? Don't worry about it. Everything's gonna be over once we press this. Hold up, bro. Hold up, bro. You're telling me that you want me... Not only does she just call me a chump, but we're like following her command. As if we don't know she's the one who put us up to this BS in the beginning, bro. Like, we're just gonna... Fall in line just to get these dead motherfuckers back, bro. Are you serious, bro? Man. No, I need something to happen right now. Somebody needs to show up. Man so down. We just have to press graduate, right? If we do that, we can go home, right? I don't even believe that. I can go back. With this, I can finally go back. He's right. With this, we can finally go back. This will be the end. And our friends who die will be saved. That's way beyond what we expected. Then it's safe to say that this is the good ending, right? No, bro. You don't think you don't think Monokuma Junko is up to some BS? Uh yeah, yeah, yeah. Stall, 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 stall. Hey, what are you doing? It's decided by a majority vote. So don't just think about it and, and press graduate! Don't you want to go back home? I don't care if you want to stay here, but don't drag us into it. What do you have to poot? I can go back. Bro, stop telling me that. With this, I can finally go back. He's right. With this, we can finally go back. This would be the end. Bro, what? I just, I chose. I chose. I don't want to choose anything. I mean... Sure then. If you if you want to leave, bro, whatever. Do what you do. I got it. Don't press it. This is Junko's trap. <laughs> what the heck? That guy from earlier is back again. It's not again. This time it's the real one. Real? I'm Makoto Naegi. Makoto Naegi of the Future Foundation. This, this guy. Is the real Makoto Naiji? This nigga, when me put my burrito down, then this is the guy I spoke to. I'm sorry I'm late. I actually wanted to come rescue you sooner, but... Thanks to the virus infecting the Neo World program, I wasn't able to enter. Just when the chumps are in a pinch, he's suddenly able to enter for reasons unknown. Yeah, that, that's, that, that's that plot for you. That's that plot for you. What you thought this wasn't an anime, girl? Shut your ass up. And thus, the main character gallantly appears. So Makoto, even though we played as Hajime, is still main character. Haji is really a, a player too, ass. Thank you, bro. <laughs> so cool. <laughs> I'm drooling. I mean, Mako so Makoto just shows up and gets her super moist, bro. That's crazy. Did you also time my arrival? No, it doesn't matter. Focus, bro. I'm going to save everyone. And then I'm going to settle this between us once and for all. Whoa. It's personal. Are you talking to me? Ah, I'm drooling. I can't stop my leaking. That's how I need my girl to, to be every time I wake up and she's looking at me, bro. 
Exactly like that, bro. How were you able to get here, Makoto? Since I used my tricks to hack into the program, he must have hacked in with his tricks too, right? Tricks are for kids. Tricks are for kids. I hacked in with my skill and poise. That's also how you kept your memories, right? Even though you haven't aged a day, just like these guys. If I hadn't, then I wouldn't have been able to save everyone. Don't you understand? It doesn't matter how you got here. As long as you're here, you'll be treated like one of my students. Makoto, is that true? Which means you must respect my authority. Respect my authority. I already know the risks of being here. <sighs> you always had such reckless hope. I love you so much that you disgust me. Just what do you mean by trap? What is Juko's trap? Loki, that last line that she just hit us with, this one right here, y'all. I love you so much that you disgust me. That's y'all towards me. I'm already knowing. It doesn't matter. We can finally end this, you know? If we get out of here, it'll all resolve itself peacefully. After all this, I can't let you get in the way. I won't let you get away. The fact that you guys are even thinking like that is Junko's trap. Huh? Y'all are really not catching on to her, bro. Like, how many times has she trapped you? All the facts. All the facts, bro, that she's that you've been slapped with throughout this entire killing game. Like, why would you just trust her? For the sake of some friends, bro? You realize the people who died was in here trying to body y'all and get away with it? Like, shut Y'all kill me, bro. Nay, none of y'all in here made relationships that made you feel like family. Besides Haji and Chiaki. That's the only person that y'all should be fending, like fighting for like this. That's not true. Some people did get body like, you know. Really, the only person that needed to stay body was your was your bodyguard for you, Hiko. She really, she really. Like, she was really on some murder, bro. She's lying to you about your dead friends coming back to life. Oh, wow. Okay. I, I thought maybe she. God. Okay. Okay. Well, like, they staying dead then. Sorry, y'all. Hey, little old me. As soon as she said that, I would have flipped the script and, like, smashed the two buttons in front of my little uh, altar, bro. Like, whatever they. The podium. Who do we trust? Not her. What are you talking about? If you knew Junko's true goal, you'd know she's lying. You know her goal? Oh, you know what? Maybe they. this is their first time actually seeing her, so they don't know who to believe, but they definitely saw her turn from Monokuma to her, so... Yeah. Not hearing it. Junko's goal is to convert the Hope Restoration Program to the Despair Restoration Program. The Despair Restoration Program? Golly, everybody in there sweating bullets, bro. Golly, somebody cranked the AC up. As part of the graduation program, your avatar's memory and consciousness is uploaded into your real body. However, none of us expected that any of the avatars would get deleted. Junko has taken advantage of that opportunity. She intends to use her version of Alter Ego, the AI she stole my friend's skill to create, and upload herself into the bodies of everyone whose avatar was deleted. Golly. What? All right. Then... Everyone who died isn't going to come back to life. They're going to be taken over by Junko? What the fuck? Like the real world, once an avatar is deleted from this virtual world, it can't be recovered. It's actually impossible to revive them. That doesn't mean I was lying, you know? I just didn't make some things clear. Oh, brother, bro. Even if they're overwritten by my alter ego, it doesn't mean they'll be a completely different person. The data of everyone who died is stored within me, so I'm sure I can convincingly act out their personalities. Good. Don't mess with me. Yuck. In fact, I have a lot of data on Fuyuhiko, so I know some things that'll make you happy. Oh! She finna try and smash! As, uh, I forget, I forget his bodyguard's name, bro. He, she is going to, she is going to smash that man. She wants to smash that man virtually, bro. I can play a version of Peko that's more to your liking than she ever was. <laughs> Fui Higo, how do you feel about that? You said, don't fucking mess with me! Cause I'm kinda turned on! <laughs> Operation Junkify All Mankind 
begins here. Fuyuhiko, you're not fooling us, bro. We know, we know. Mm. Jukify all mankind. After uploading my alter ego into everyone who died, I'm gonna take over the Future Foundation's headquarters. Because we're all... <laughs> Eventually, there's gonna be a whole lot of me's all over the world. Look how... Look how boring this world looks, bro. It looks like a bunch of, like... Like, colony ants, bro. With this, my despair utopia, where you can despair as you please, Junko Land, will be complete. Does this idiot not realize you're despairing against yourself at that point? Like, there's nobody there but you, so it's just despair for you only. Oh, brother. That's Operation junko Fi All Mankind in a nutshell. Oh, yeah! Our dreams are expanding and... They don't echo yourself. At that point, it's not even despair anymore because if everything is despair the way that you like it, that's pleasure. Isn't that like defeating the purpose? Don't you need somebody to put despair on to feel that despair? You ain't think this through. That messed up plan is your goal? Then why didn't you just kill all of us? If you did, you could have taken over all of our bodies. Wouldn't that have been more convenient for He's you? He's got a point. Is that what you want me to do? Is it still too late to do that? I mean, no. Like, what do you want to do, though? No. There's a reason Junko couldn't do that. That's why she made you guys kill each other. There's a reason she couldn't. The reason she wasn't able to do that, was it because there was something she didn't do? If so, then the reason was... Ooh. Okay. Got it. Because there's people because watching. Because school trip's rules. Even a monster like her has to follow the rules of the school trip? Wait, I don't... Wait, people were watching the Junko first time, right? Junko usurped Usami's authority as an observer, and her role as your teacher. However, according to the rules of the school trip, even Usami had to follow up. That's why when Junko took over her position, she had no choice but to follow the rules as well. The lead teacher cannot directly interfere with the students. So, the rules were protecting us? Man, I was so annoyed. I had the authority to add rules, but no authority to delete rules. Oh well, even if I could have deleted rules, I was still busy with my whole taking over your bodies plan. So you made us kill each other, because you couldn't kill us yourself. Is that how you were able to increase the number of bodies you can take over? Like I said, I personally didn't care about the outcome of the killings. How dare you look down on us? Don't fuck with me. What about our lives? Chump change. Damn, she issue with the loser, bro. Hold that L, bro. Wow, dude, don't let her disrespect you. Hop over the table, slap her. <sighs> I kind of messed with my eye. I. I won't forgive you. I will never, ever fucking forgive you! Okay, bro. You probably got the best, bro. She said she has infinite info on you, bro. She will, she will take care, bro. I wish somebody had infinite info on me. Damn, he got it good. So that's your trap. Make us choose graduate so you can take over everyone's body with the graduation program. How, how can you be so cruel? Y'all are idiots for even thinking she would just help because Junko and Oshima is the true old Monokuma. Despair. Like, stop, bro. We know about her, bro. She doesn't yearn for any kind of future at all, she fills every person she meets with despair. Oh, he okay. Fuyuhiko would have caught an STD. That's that's true. That's true. Good move, uh, Fuyuhiko. Wait, that's good not to trust it. That's good not to trust it. I wouldn't encourage him just going inside raw anyway. What are we talking about? This is high school. I'm gonna relax. That's my Makoto. You understand me so well. For me, despair is not a goal or a set of principles or a lifestyle or even an instinct. It's what defines me as Junko and Ashima. It's just my characterization. That's why I'm able to pursue despair with such purity. So you're saying you only exist to fill people with despair? For example, 
Want to hear about a beautiful memory that even I, who gets bored easily, still remember fondly? Picture thousands of fools who are madly in love with me, dying one by one like insects doused with bug spray. And the best part is, they did it to themselves, you know? Thousands of humans falling like dominoes! Oh, that memory is so beautiful! It made my brain melt! Yeah, about that. Does that story have a happy ending? Could it be? Is she talking about them right now? Um, maybe the reserve. Yeah, because then they all oh, suicide supposedly. Are you talking about the reserve course's mass suicide? Ooh, damn! Everything she's talking about is a lie. Oh yeah, I totally forgot you're a survivor of the reserve course. Ooh. By the way, I'm so sorry for your loss. Uh, Hajime was not a simp, simp, bro. A Simpson. He's not a simp. M mass suicide? What's she talking about? Golly, though. Our, oh incident. man, man. Police! Yo, Spike is a Spike is a real fool for this one, bro. Maybe I need I need a girlfriend. An incident where 2,357 people from the reserve course all killed themselves. Junko probably made them do it. 2,357 people? That's an outrageous number. You don't have to be that surprised. You all look like your parents, friends, and lovers all tied at once. Mm, that was so rude of me. There's no way you guys even have meaningful relationships like that anymore. I mean, you're all ultimate despair. You guys have already eaten your fill of despair. I... I do not really know what you are trying to say. Junko robs the futures of everyone she interacts with. You ultimate despairs are among her many victims. If someone like me is born, that means the world is yearning for despair. Okay. That's wrong. The world isn't yearning for despair. That's the reason we can't let you escape. Mm. But if you do that, you guys won't be able to return to the real world, right? Huh? Damn. If we choose graduate to get out of here. The graduation program will act. Yeah, but right. we're not doing that though. If that happens, Junko's alter ego right. will be uploaded into the bodies of the dead. That's out. That's out. Does that mean we gotta stay here to keep her from getting out? Wait, Makoto, you don't have no plan? What, what the heck? Why does it have to be like that? This dude said he was gonna save us. Save us, bro. It's hop hop in the mix. for you guys. But it's awfully convenient for the future foundation. Makoto, get in the mix, bro. You over there pointing hell. Hell. They'll be able to keep all the ultimate despairs, including me, trapped in this game forever. Wrong. That's not it. Why are you scared? But ultimate despair is hated worldwide, and their lives are no doubt targeted by the future foundation. Oh well. If you don't want to acknowledge that, I guess it just can't be helped. Can't be helped. <laughs> LOL. This is nothing to LOL. Right, about. what are you talking about? But it's so ironic. You came all the way here just to find out that graduating is the wrong choice. And you really try to play us. Even though you came all this way to win the game. Even though you kept sacrificing your friends to win. <sighs> you burp? The goal you guys squirmed to reach was wrong all along. Isn't that just so fucking tragic? Oh, brother, bro. Stop it! It was all a mistake? This is really just a mistake. Is it a mistake to think we'd go home alive all along? What about the killings in the class trials? Was this just a meaningless killing game where the ultimate despairs killed each other off? That... This is just too... Don't give up yet! There is a way you guys can get out of here without letting Junko out. What's been taking you so long to talk? Huh? No, no, there's no way such a convenient... There is? Really? Well, that's the first I've heard of it. First she's heard of it, then it's a way that even Junko doesn't know, right? The way to get out that Junko doesn't know about, it might be that. Bro, shouldn't we be asking Makoto? Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. 
Ooh. Are you talking about the shutdown sequence? Damn, what nigga forgot. Shutdown sequence? What is that? It's a hidden command I set up in the Neo World program. Okay. H hidden command? Are you unbuttoning? Ah. Basically, I never believed the Neo World program was a perfect solution. Right. There was always a possibility that Usami's hope might have made things even worse for you guys. So I prepared a way to shut down the program in case of emergency. Okay. As I recall, you said it was a command that not even the teacher can stop. Right, I just read that in a note, yes sir. And that means even Junko can't stop. Right, bro. Dear me, I have an unfortunate announcement to make, class. You cannot activate the shutdown. Why not? Huh? You... You know about it. More importantly, do you know why? Do you know why you can't activate the shutdown? No, no, I want to know how you know about it. Cause this game just be like just loop de looping the 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 logic all around the place, bro. Sometimes it's there, sometimes it's absent, bro. How did you know about it? Not enough people know authority because it's because it's broken. It has to be people. It has to be people. I see. What's the amount though? Because there's not enough people. <laughs> Pay attention, class. According to my information, in order to initiate the shutdown, out of 15 people, more than half of them must press graduate and repeat at the same time. Oh, that's right. That's right. There's only about six of us. Am I correct? However, out of 15 people, including Makoto, there are only six people here. Even if you want to cheat, I won't let you. They about to hit us with some fan service. They about to hit us with some fan service right now. They need to bring back my nigga though, bro. If they're gonna do this, do it right. Do it right. There's only six people here and uh, somebody just showed up out of nowhere. Hey, I need to see him. Come on, Spike. Let's go, Spike. The shutdown sequence won't activate unless it knows that different people initiated it. So it's totally impossible. You thought Makoto showing up was totally impossible. Why are you? Okay. Uh oh. Uh oh. Uh oh. Uh oh. You totally saw through that supposedly hidden command. No need to worry. Even I knew we couldn't activate the shutdown. You still came here when you knew we had no Let's chance. Let's go. Of winning? It's not that we have no chance of winning. The only reason I'm here is because there is a chance. Then try explaining it to us. What is this chance of winning of which you about to get doodled on? You about to get doodled on? Doodled on. I believe. Oh, uh, I can't hear you. You gotta speak up since you're so puny. I believe in them. I believe they will definitely come. That's what I'm talking about. Them? That's yes! not something you need to take your time saying. Let's go! Okay! Try putting your Bro! Chiyoko! Byakuya! I knew you guys would come! We'd be better off leaving behind someone who jumps to conclusions without listening to our warnings. Uh, I'm sorry. Even though it took some time for two people to enter the program simultaneously, it appears we made it. I mean, I'm, I mean, yeah, like, I, I'm, yeah, they cool, but like, hey, what's going on? Why are there more people again? 
That is some bullshit, bro. Bring the whole squad back. I'm asking for one thing, bro. How exciting. Yo, Spike's writing sometimes is just like... Ages. It's like opening your high school yearbook 10 years later. Like, I'll be right there with him, and then he just dropped a ball, bro. Why would you not bring in the one piece of comedic relief, bro? I must say, now that I'm seeing her up close, she's much bigger than I remember. You are not funny, bro. Let Hero come in and be... Oh my gosh, bro. What? What kind of man isn't excited by big women? Once you gain some more experience, you'll understand. That's facts, that's facts, that's facts. There's a lot of kinky things you can do with big girls. That's a fact. Shut up. <laughs> I forgot bro does that. I forgot he does that. Okay. Miyakuya, you're alive. But you're so skinny now. I feel so bad for you. Look at Spike, you are not slick, bro. We know exactly what you was trying to do with that one, bro. That You shut up too. Damn. Um are you two also from the Future Foundation? No, it's probably not just that. The six of you join the Future Foundation because you agree with our ideals, right? The Future Foundation rescued you from the tragedy <gasps> you survived and helped you recover your memories. Tragedy? If the Killing School Life is referring to that, you guys are the survivors of the killing school life who previously defeated Junko, right? Yeah, that's right. Th there's three of them here now? The former heroes plunging themselves into the game world, ignoring all danger. Jeez, stupids! Making such a suicidal move! Did you really want to see me that badly? This is still kind of cool, though. This is still kind of cool. It's still fan service, but damn, y'all dropped the ball. Am I the only one that really liked it? It's because I, be, I was smoking at the time. Heavy, bro. A nigga related. It can't be helped. In order to stop you, that suicidal move was our only choice. So how about it? There are eight people now. We have enough to activate the shutdown sequence. Let's wrap this game up, ladies and gentlemen. We are almost done. We are almost out of here. Finally. Why are you crying? Because we because we won. <laughs> you guys showed up looking all cool and stuff. Look at and her. Now all the ultimate despairs. What about them? Uh, they'll be treated like even bigger chumps. Bro, we about to leave your ass. You're the only ultimate despair here. Goodbye. You said it again. That's that Monokuma in her. Just ignore her. Let's go. As long as we activate the shutdown sequence, it'll be the end of her in this messed up world. And this messed up world, why are hey, you... Can I ask you something? If we do shut down the program, what will happen to us? No need to worry. We won't let you get hurt. It's not just that. We want a more detailed explanation. If you shut down the Neo World program, everything within the program will be deleted. It will obviously delete Alter Ego Junko, along with your avatars here. So you're saying we're going to be deleted too? It doesn't mean you'll be deleted. The program will just finish without completing the graduation program. Hold on, bro. What does that mean for us? Your avatars will not upload. So you will revert to your original state before you enter the program. Kyoko, it's good to see you, but like, it just don't hit the same. I needed, I needed, I needed everybody. Huh? Is there a reason to tell them all that? They have to know everything, or else they won't agree to do it. Hold on a second. If we go back to our original selves before we enter the program. You're gonna be evil, boy. You're gonna be evil. You... I see. You can go right back to that stone cold killer you was with Junko. Does that mean we'll go back to being ultimate despair? Yeah, I imagine without Junko, y'all gonna get bodied, though. They... <laughs> what if that's what they're trying to do? They're trying to. That's right. 
Back to being hopelessly controlled by me. You won't be when here. You used to feel despair upon despair. You won't even be here. No! Are, are you fucking serious? Can't you do anything about it? I understand your concern, but this is the only way to stop Junko. It might be a painful decision, but I know you guys will be able to overcome it. That's why, in order to defeat despair, I want you guys to fight alongside us. We still have to fight? I... I thought we finally reached the end! Don't worry. Once you get out, we will do our best to support you. It doesn't sound like some government shit, bro. But I thought the Future Foundation wanted to kill every last ultimate despair. Ooh. When you say support, do you mean I'll make sure you don't suffer when I kill you, or...? This game, this game, this game is a little bit of that social commentary. Of course not. We would never allow that to happen. Then what is your plan? It's gonna be alright. Your real bodies have just been brainwashed. That's why I'm pretty sure you'll quickly revert back to the state you're in right now. Y'all ever done this before? Can you stop saying cheesy stuff like brainwashed? Washing your brain is like really nasty. But, but still, even if our brainwashing is undone, the memories we've made up till now will be erased, right? You want to remember what happened here? Does that mean we'll completely forget everything we did on this island? I don't want that. So you want to remember how you got Nekamaru killed? And now how he's in your pocket, boo and oil all in your pockets and skirt? It doesn't matter what you want. That's the reality. Nigga leaking WD-40 all down your thigh, but you... You want to remember why that's happening. Every meaningless thing that happened here will vanish from your minds. Meaningless. Vanish. Does that include her too? I thought he was talking about Junko. You already know what he's talking about, bro. If we lose our memories of this world, we're also going to forget she ever existed. Right? If that happens, does it really mean that that she in existence confined to this world? Is she really going to disappear? She risked her life to protect us. And we won't even remember she existed. Memory's not all that'll go back to normal. If you've lost a limb, like Nagito, it'll still be gone when... <gasps> Please stop! Going back to reality in that condition, that's like a bad joke. You're not joking. That is your past. Nobody can escape their past. Facts, facts, facts. We don't know anything about that past! Also facts. Hey, why... Why did we become ultimate despair in the first place? That's a great question. I asked the same thing <clears throat> in the real world, but nobody would give me an answer. Oh, brother, bro. It seems my teachings were quite thorough. However, if you ask me... People who claim to stuff like hope, talent, or admiration are truly the weakest. Damn. Is she coming from my life? Huh? Guys who desperately want to reach the top. They don't think about what'll happen when they're pushed off. Mmm. She ain't talking about me. I'm always thinking about that, bro. A nigga scary, bro. I don't play that. Always gotta have a, a backup plan. Always gotta have some residual, some savings, everything, bro. Probably too concerned with having a really nice view while they condescend to others. Shoving off guys like that is so easy. <laughs> I happen to know 17,082 ways to do that. The point is, the moment you cling to talent and hope, despair has already set in. That's not even an explanation. Then, what if you think about it like this? It turns out that you guys being ultimate despair was just part of the game world. And in truth, those guys from the Future Foundation might be part of the game world too. They're simply side characters of the game world whose role is to offer hopeless hope to you guys. Well, after saying all that, I don't even know what's real and what's a game anymore. It's all a game. You already said that. I don't know if you're trying to trip me up again, but you already, you know, you need to stop it. Are you kidding around? Don't cry, bro. I hate seeing that face from him, bro. That hurts my heart, bro. Enough. My patience is wearing thin. Let's hurry and start the shutdown sequence already. 
Before you do that, we gotta do some reviewing. <clears throat> when you guys activate the shutdown, <clears throat> you'll revert back to when you were known as Ultimate Despair. Aren't you using your cell phone? Why are you pulling up a book now? Like... When you guys activate the shutdown, you'll revert back to when you... Okay. And your dead friends will never be revived. Sadly. And the embodiment of despair, aka me, will be erased, thereby preserving hope in the real world. Now then, will the hope of the future foundation win, or will my despair win? Dang, she said either. Sa Excuse me, that is you slapping. She's saying either sacrifice yourself to kill me, or let me live, bring your friends back, and. But then it's not even really their friends. There's only one answer here. All right! Things are starting to heat up! This last little chapter kind of cool. I'm not even gonna lie to you. This isn't a game, you know. Au contraire. This is a game. The game of hope and despair that started with your killing school life. That explains why these chumps who weren't around last time have been reduced to mere side characters. I think what is throwing me off though is the timeline. I think Danganronpa Trigger Happy Havoc is part two in the anime. And then this right here is part three. But there's no beginning as to how Junko and did like we're learning about the we're learning about what happened before Trigger Happy Havoc in this game so it goes this game for this these gnats bro this game for the story but then this is part one then trigger happy havoc the first game for part two and then this actual game for part three you learn you know what i'm saying i hope that i hope that made sense bro but like i want to see like how junko like made all this is that what's in the anime maybe 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 that explains why these chumps who weren't around last time have been reduced to mere side characters <laughs> Called us chumps again. What are you gonna do about it, dude? Um, because it's true. There go to the, uh, the uh, I don't know why I want to say Hisoka, bruh. Watching too much Hunter Hunter. Most importantly, the killing school trip wasn't just for your sake. Huh? There was a more important goal there. The goal of luring a specific group of people. Ooh. Ah, since now's a great time, why don't we make that the question? Question? As long as we're in the game world, the rules say I gotta ask questions every now and then. So, question. Who did I lure and how did I do it? I mean, they hear it now. It is. I get bored easily. So the same outcome as the killing school life would be a pain in the ass. Okie dokie, let's all think about it together. The same outcome as the killing school life. Do I just have to remember what occurred there? The people with Junko lured. The method. I should try connecting those dots. There should be an answer there. Are we really doing a logic dive in front of Makoto again, bro? I know it was the fake one last time, but are you serious? This nigga left to think. Golly, bro. You in the middle of a life and death situation and this is what you want to do in your mind. Who needs hero when you're doing this? I'm not gonna lie though, I'm kinda hating, but I would love to do this in my own mind, bro. Like, just skateboard, bro. Y'all said I got room for all types of ramps and, and, and I'm not even finna hear it, bro. Quarter pipes, all types of shit, bro. You might be right. Your shit is full of Fortnite build battle tactics. Who did Junko Inoshima want to lure? The Future Foundation. She's trying to. She's trying to get. She's trying to get us back, bro. This is all about payback. The big payback. I'm actually kind of curious as to what happened before Junko. Like, you know what I mean? Why did this last little chapter kind of get me interested again, bro? This, this spike kind of cool. <laughs> oh my gosh, bro! Spike kind of cool. Uh, I'm bodying this. Where, where's my boost at? 
I know one thing. This, this game better not glitch in the middle of this recording. Give me my boost. Where's my... What bait was used to lure the few... Uh, the killings, duh. You don't think, you don't think that they was watching? They didn't even know Junko was here. How am I losing at this part, bro? Bro, these ramps are not difficult. They really like throwing this stuff at me like, oh man, the last logic dive. We're really gonna get him with this. They did give me with a few of them now. What did Junko use to force them to watch the killings? Look at these other options, bro. I mean, these questions blew, bro. Oh, we're not doing this in front of a live audience no more. I was wrong about that. Okay, okay, okay. Damn, so she, she made sure that they... Okay. I was kind of curious because when, when Makoto showed up in that little that little silhouette, the little black box he was in, I was like, it's okay. All coming together. He didn't mention he was watching though, but I figure if, if they're broadcasting to national TV, they're Gosh, watching it, bro. You use the surveillance cameras. Duh. Now, now what I want to know is if everybody's watching this or was it just them? Mm. You were trying to lure the Future Foundation by showing them the footage you were recording, weren't you? The surveillance cameras? That's what they were being used for? Because these people don't know. These people don't. Okay, 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 okay. In the previous Killing School Life, the surveillance camera footage was broadcast outside of the school. So you, do you know? You used the cameras that were placed throughout the entire island for the same purpose. So everybody was watching. Ding, ding, ding. I was broadcasting the Killing School trip live to every member of the Future Foundation. Never mind then. The footage you recorded with the surveillance cameras was shown to the Future Foundation? What shall I do? I did a lot of disgraceful things in front of those cameras. You got your OnlyFans popping? You sure did kuya who are you judging bro like if you watched it you just as bad i would never be queen now please forget what you saw so you guys were watching us then why didn't you come rescue us earlier we tried to hack in many times but the virus within the program blocked us at every turn not only that the neo world program stopped accepting shutdown commands from the outside as a last resort, we considered cutting power to the program, but... We didn't know what would happen to the subjects if we cut the power while the program was still running. Okay, okay. There's no way we'd jeopardize your safety by taking such a gamble. Even so, we kept trying over and over again, until it was finally possible for us to enter the program just a short time ago. And you came all the way here when you knew it was a trap. I get it. You couldn't just leave them alone. If you saw people dying one by one with your own eyes by the same killing game you guys played, Hulk dictates that you act all high and mighty and say, Oh, I'm definitely gonna stop it this time, right? Yuck. Hey, don't tell me that's the reason you made us go through all this. Of course we made you do it for that reason. We orchestrated this game instead of killing you outright solely to show it off to the Future Foundation. We were forced to solve puzzles and riddles just so you could show it off to the future bro, foundation? Bro, she just said that, bro. That's why you guys are chumps. You're just the bait I use to catch a big fish called the Future Foundation. But it's not my fault, you know. This game is a fight between the Future Foundation and me. You guys were just instigators in the background. But you guys already knew that when you chose to play this game, right? Just one second, please! That sounds as though we... As though we wanted to come to this world of our own free will. But that's precisely the truth. Mm. You guys chose to be instigators, and you were willingly taken into the Neo World program to provide the opportunity I needed to push this battle between hope and despair into overtime. That's right. 
The reason the ultimate despairs began killing each other was set up by the group itself. That's just your imagination. Oh, naive Makoto totally fell for the trap. Oh, and now your face is filled with a lovely shade of despair. Whoa, that despair is fucking obvious. You're here to rescue the assholes who set this up in the first place. The word despair is starting to get cringy, bro. Don't go blaming us for this. This whole, like, hoping despair dynamic. Thank you. It's all thanks to you guys. This time around, I might be able to fill these guys with despair. We do not feel despair. Even if this was all a trap, we will never regret coming here. And this is the only thing we could do to stop you. But nevertheless, it's <sighs> all over. We will shut you down and end all of this. You're pretty fucking desperate. Oh, that's pretty fucking obvious. Golly, you got a filthy mouth. If you don't initiate the shutdown, those future Foundation fuckwits are going to be trapped here forever. Trapped? Why would that happen? <laughs> Didn't I already explain it? You know, the graduation exam rule? But that's not all, right? In order to pass the graduation exam, there was one more requirement. The teacher, yup, the teacher gotta be involved. I see! As I recall, we also need the teacher's final decision. Whack. Obviously, there's no way I'd let the members of the Future Foundation graduate. So if you can't activate the shutdown, the Foundation will enter the endless life of repeating the grade! Hmm. That's only if the shutdown sequence doesn't activate, right? But that's impossible. Everyone here understands how dangerous it is to release you into the real world. We know that. All too well. I mean... She's been bad-mouthing us this whole time. Oh. Looks like you shouldn't have talked so much. Out of the mouth comes evil, so they say. It's true that we fell for this trap, and that we run the risk of not being able to go back. But what's wrong with that? Thinking we'd back down because of something like that is a huge mistake. That's my mind. Thinking your little shutdown plan will succeed is a huge mistake. Huh? You're totally overestimating those chumps over there. There's no way they'll start the shutdown <laughs> sequence. Oh, that's so disrespectful. Why not? Look upon their faces. Bro said, why not it if she's not just roasting right now? They bro. look like piglets who were forced to watch their mom roasting on a spit. There's no fucking way they'll initiate the shutdown just to go back to being ultimate despair. That is... Well... Junko... I don't care what you say. I've decided to believe in everyone. It's a lot of pressure, Big Makoto. It's true that they walked the wrong path before, but that's all in the past now. What I believe in is not their past, but their futures. Okay. Okay. <laughs> I was totally waiting for a protagonist to fly like that. When I crush you with this bear, that jacks the sea. You are here, Sokka. No matter what you do to me, I will never fall into despair. Oh, excuse me. He, Sokka. Y'all got on me last time on the stream. Ah, uh, wrong, wrong. I'm not the one who's going to make you fall into despair. That's the Mastermind's job, and they'll be appearing very soon. Mastermind? Who is that? Mastermind? Someone else is coming? Bro, I got a whole nother hour, you said? Fuck it. That can't be. It's just a bluff. You should never make the last character who appears in a detective story turn out to be the mastermind. But I always fall into that pattern, so I was kind of worried about that. Enough already. What are you talking about? Oh well. Let's bring him out with lots of energy. It's Mr. Izuru Kamakura! Izuru... Kamakura? The headmaster, the headmaster, the headmaster. The person was called the ultimate hope, but that shouldn't be all he was. That's right, I've seen a person called Iziru Kamakura somewhere else. That person was... Oh, the founder, not the headmaster, the founder, the founder. 
That's right. I remember his picture. Izuru Kamakura. Isn't that the name of the founder of Hope's Peak Academy? There you go. Ugly it was written ass. on the placard beneath the portrait of the Academy's founder. That name. It was definitely Izuru Kamakura, right? However, based on the information I know, the man known as Izuru Kamakura... If I recall, he's a super genius who acquired many talents. He was even called the ultimate hope, right? Hmm? Does the founder have the same name as that ultimate hope guy? Is that kind of coincidence even possible? The future foundation might know something, right? How about it, Kyoko? Even within Hope's Peak Academy, there's very little information about a person called Izuru Kamukura. It's a mystery if such a person ever really existed. And not just that, the matter was closed without ever being settled because of that incident. If you do not know, then please allow me. Providing hopelessly skilled explanations is a quirk of mine. The reason Izuru's existence continues to be such a mystery is because the Academy hid it. Why did the Academy hide his existence? If I recall, they were trying to protect their superior talent. They even called it Mankind's Hope, correct? However, that prodigious student ended up killing 13 student council members at Hope's Peak Academy. Izuru is the killer responsible for Hope's Peak Academy's biggest, most awful event. And you're the one who set it up, right? Information about Izuru completely vanished after that incident. <sighs> we thought Junko and Ashima killed them? Oh, don't say such cruel things. Izuru Kamakura is very much alive. Hmm. Isn't that right, Hajime? What? I am... what? Like I said, you're Izuru Kamakura. What? Huh? Alrighty! If you don't understand, I'll explain it to you till you do understand! You're Izuru Kamakura, you're Izuru Kamakura, you're Izuru Kamakura, you're Izuru Kamakura, you're... Kamakura, you're... No. Hold on! Seriously, what are you talking about? Liar! There's no way. There's no way Hajime is Izuru Kamukura! How does that even make sense, bro? Izuru is that ultimate hope, right? But Hajime is. Is Hajime. That's right. Hajime is one of those reserve course dropouts and has no talent whatsoever. Okay. But the fact that he's really Izuru Kamakura makes all this much more hopeless. I'm... What? Izuru Kamakura? What are you gonna ask me? What? What? Good news, Hajime! Even though you were mocked for being a reserve course student, he had a talent all along! Ultimate Hope! How can someone from the reserve course have such an amazing talent like that. In order to hide Izuru's identity, was he hidden in the reserve course? Then Hajime's name is fake? Th there's no doubt I'm Hajime Hinata. I've Aww. always had that name ever since I was born. Then Izuru is your fake name? Hey, you weren't lying to us, right? I do not want any more last-minute plot twists. Could it be created hope? It might be Izuru. Created hope was the only thing that I saw. And it's something that I have to, um, I have to co-sign. Good. Let me see what, it, what in here talks about hope. What are my bullets, bro? Okay. Even okay. though you were more than Izuru is your- Hey, you weren't- I didn't know what any more luck. Could it be created hope? Thank that you. That must be it. Let's keep the story going. I'm over here like, ah. Created hope. Are you talking about the hope cultivation plan? Hope cultivation plan. What is that? A while back, I saw a file kept by the Future Foundation. For many years, Hope's Peak Academy was researching a breakthrough plan 
to cultivate personal talent. It's true it was a breakthrough plan. After all, it was a plan to create the perfect genius. Create? For the longest time, the Hope Cultivation Plan was the earnest wish of Hope's Peak Academy. In fact, that's why the Academy was established. Part of that plan was researching the talents of Ultimates. Because the plan was so important, they adopted the name of the Academy's founder. And called it the Izuru Kamakura Project. Izuru Kamakura Project? Just a little while ago, they were finally able to reach the experimental stage of that plan. From there, they set their sights on the reserve course dropouts to use them as lab rats. Why did they use the reserve course as lab rats? A plan to create talent artificially requires test subjects that are wholly lacking in talent. From that group of reserve course students, the one who was finally chosen was... Hajime, who stands before you now. Why me? Because you admired Hope's Peak Academy more than anybody else. You still don't get it. You were used by the Academy. They exploited your feelings of admiration toward hope and talent just to use you as a lab rat. What? See? Didn't I tell you? The moment you cling to talent and hope, despair has already set in. Lies. That's definitely a lie. And after many surprises, Hajime Hinata was transformed into Izuru 1.0! Did you say transformed? What did they do to him? Unless you're willing to go to extremes, it's impossible to change a normal person into a perfect genius. So naturally, they went to extremes. Oh, By directly brother. interfering with his brain, Hope's Peak Academy transformed Hajime Hinata into a completely different person whose specialty is talent itself, known as Izuru Kamakura. Oh, brother. Eventually, brother. Izuru became an ultimate despair, thanks to me. But all I did to Izuru was simply break his spirit. That's nothing compared to what Hope's Peak Academy did to him. Not even close. Seriously, it's scary how determined the researchers were to mess with the human brain that much. Okay. They had a good thing going, you know, they had a good thing going. They just started doing all this, bro. such inhumane acts that nobody else is capable of with such a calm mind and a steady hand. I admire it so much, it makes my mind numb. By the way, you're just a simple avatar right now. So even if you touch your head, you won't feel the scar. <laughs> Did they really do something like that? But if you think about it, if Hajime gets out of here, he's gonna be a super genius, right? Hajime's not going to be Hajime. Like I said, he's not Hajime. <laughs> he's a completely different person whose specialty is talent itself. D different person? How is he different? My nigga. All of his senses, emotions, thoughts, and hobbies that interfere with acquiring talent have been excised. Huh? All of his memories of the past have been forcefully suppressed into the darkest recesses of his mind. Huh? Emotions? Thoughts? Hobbies? He doesn't even have a memory? It sounds like he is a completely different person. Yeah! So that's why it's so surprising that Hachime even exists here at all. Even if he's just an avatar. The Neo World program must have dug up those memories and rebuilt his old personality from data from the past. I cannot help but feel impressed that the Neo World program was able to accomplish such a feat. But as for Hajime, he probably would have been better off if he stayed erased. Damn. Then... When Hajime returns to his original state after the shutdown, he'll disappear. D disappear? All that will remain is Izuru Kamakura, an entirely different personality created by Hope Speak Academy. Wow. 
He will no longer be Hajime Hinata. Disappear. I am going to disappear. Disappear, 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 disappear. Golly, that's but no matter what happens, it's of no concern to me. That's me after my brain transplant. They did a good job on the hair. God, la, la. I will not be able to participate in what lies ahead. Hmm. Excuse me. Really? I don't really understand, but I guess we have to part ways for a while. It's disappointing. We seem to get to get along pretty well. Hey, can I see you again? There's no reason to meet again. After all, you are boring. Your talent, your thoughts, your entire existence is boring to me. You really don't play along, do you, bitch? <laughs> Bro. What's that? Me? No, that's that's not me. That's what you are. That's who Izuru Kamakura is. You're the one who brought me into this world. You're Izuru Kamakura, the mastermind behind all of this. Huh? Could it be? The one who uploaded you into the Neo World program was. It's not me. Just so you know. As long as your brain has been messed with, you can't undo it, no matter how hard you try. <laughs> Have no way to be saved, you say? But you already know what you must do. Damn, Haji. This is whack, bro. What's whack about Haji's character, bro, is that he literally is just a loser the entire time. Not a loser, but like... He shows up in the game. Nope, there was nobody with the talent. He shows up, he finds out he's a reserve course student. Then on top of that, he finds out he was a reserve course student who was then snatched away, had his, had his personality, his memories, everything pushed to the recesses of his brain so that the founder could use his body and essentially when when he leaves or whatever happens after this like there is no more haji the coolest thing haji did in this game was survive the suicide the, the suicide that's whack bro haji he deserved better i already know how i can be saved Wait, not graduate, not graduate. I mean, repeat, I mean, repeat, I mean, repeat. My fault, bro. My fault, bro. No, 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 no. Hold on. You can't do that. Yeah, I don't want to, I don't want to do this. If you do that, everyone. Like, if you guys don't. I can't allow the. Jeez. That's not it. What we're saying. Wait, we're still going? I want to restart. We have to protect the world from despair, you say? Okay, okay, that's getting so old. Do you really have to sacrifice yourselves just to protect the world in the first place? What if the world's hope is different from your hope? Even if the world is happy, it's meaningless if you aren't happy. That's... Plus, the Future Foundation wants to kill all the ultimate despairs, right? Once you go back to being ultimate despair, the Future Foundation's punishment time will activate. It would be absolutely dreadful if that were to happen. Not just dreadful. It's rather fucking hopeless, don't you think? <laughs> and can you guys even endure that? Everything that happened here will just end up being a meaningless game. Everything you felt, awe, friendship, love, there won't even be save data left of it. The girl you love 
and the guy you hate grow weaker and skinnier each day they lay immobilized. And in Hajime's case, his very existence is going to disappear, all because of the academy he loves so much. Will you be able to endure such despair? Who are you going to endure it for? For people you've never met before? For people who don't even appreciate you? Mm. Does that sound like hope to you? Mm. You can't believe her! That's how she works! That's what she does, so she can lure you all toward despair. There is no reason to listen to her. Hurry up and start the shutdown. Oh, hold on! What is it? Why are we still waiting? Do you still not understand what's going to happen to the real world if Junko escapes? No, I, I was just... How many victims do you think the biggest, most awful, most tragic event in human history is claimed? Right now, it's finally started to calm down. If Junko Inoshima makes it to the real world, countless victims will fill the streets. The world will regress to an era of bloodshed, chaos, and worldwide rioting. So that's why you're telling them to start the shutdown sequence? To prevent that? You're telling them to turn back into ultimate despair and lose all the memories they made in this world. Even among them, there are those who will simply cease to exist. And you're telling them to just deal with it? At this point, this is the only way. No, no, no. There is another way. As long as they choose to graduate, they can pass along their avatar's memories and everyone here will be able to hold hands and keep on living. Well, everyone who died will be taken over by me, but... Don't you think that's a better fate than being a vegetable for the rest of their life? You guys, you can't buy into this. Think carefully about which is true hope. And which is true despair. Um, what shall we do? You're asking us? You're... Telling us to decide? We're screwed. Damn it! Why'd it turn out like this? If everyone can overcome despair, you guys should be able to grasp true hope. If our memories up until now disappear. Look at my health bar, ever... look at my focus bar. I can't even the fast forward. Died. I can't even slow down. It's a wrap. It's GG's. Are you really going to let her take over your friend's bodies? No, bro. You might think I'm a fool, but... Yo, Fuyiko, you are whack, bro. I want to see Peko one more time. I knew it! If we turn back into ultimate despair, the Future Foundation might kill us, right? We These won't let them do my that. Head, my ears hurt, bro. This is all the Future Foundation's fault. They're the ones who stuck us in this messed up world! For your protection. If Junko escapes to the real world, there will be countless victims again. Uh, I know, but... Everyone's hope is in conflict. Such despair! I'm gonna shoot that. Bro, I can't do anything. Graduate or shut down. The world or me hope or despair you're telling us to choose look at my health bar bro to choose between that why 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 do we have to choose that was his logic dive i can't do it bro come on haji huh can't do it. Come on, bro. I can't choose. You guys are telling us the world's going to be destroyed unless we sacrifice ourselves. And that, I can't decide. I can't choose either one. Hajime! Don't think I saw you and uh, Akane just hold hands real quick. I saw that. Shut up! Leave me alone! My fault, bro. This, this is just too much. Why do I, why do I have to be a part of this? I mean, I'm different from the rest of you. And I don't even have a talent. But even so, I got. I got dragged into this. 
and now my existence is going to disappear <laughs> i don't understand it at all i don't understand it at all oh he killed that he bodied that line he did that both choices are hopeless how much of ourselves do we have to sacrifice this burden don't you dare make us shoulder it there's no way we can handle this on our own everyone get a hold of yourselves it's impossible for someone like me it's impossible i can't choose the future hope despair do whatever you want it's not my problem that's and there's no answer so you've chosen to make no choice at all Jeez. Once again, this went exactly as I expected. I get so hopelessly bored when everything goes according to plan. Oh well, since I have everyone's data, I kind of figured things would play out like this. That is, unless something else hopelessly unpredictable happens. Well, I can say that, but the chance of something convenient happening is Come hopeless. on! After all, this is a game. This game be fucking dragging. Hurry up! Predetermined harmony. Fine. I guess it's okay. You don't have to force yourself to make a choice. A futureless future. Hm, I think it's fine. This if that game be dragging, too. bro. As long as you don't yearn for hope. She's still you'll talking, never fall bro. Victim to despair. That goes for me too. As long as I don't yearn for despair, I'll never need to hope for it. So. Let's all free ourselves from this curse and stay here as the best of friends. Let's immerse ourselves in this tropical island life forever and ever. Forever and ever 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 and ever. My God, Lee, you gotta get your, you had enough airtime. Move the plot forward. Wow, so we really we didn't choose and now we're stuck here forever? Are we serious? Oh shit my niggas. Alright! A game reset! And with this the world will continue to loop. An eternal what does that game say in the hill? Sounds like fun. I guess it's fine to stay like this for a while. Eternal game utopia. Yeah, master, that is a wise call. What did that mess say before? In the hill? Was that German? Yes, there's no way I would forget. Everybody get shot this, in the head. Juco's Everybody gone. get shot. Boom, headshot, boom. Uh, arm right. shot. Headshot, Let's boom, boom. Headshot, gun them, bow. I'm showcase my full cooking ability. It did it. Just leave the BGM to your boogie. Uh, oh, I missed. Your body in the mouth. Hey, can I take a picture to commemorate oh, this? Oh, my hero. You get blasted too. to be too. awed by the sight of my prowess? Shut your ass up. You got, you caught two bullets. I uh, prepared move. you a training regiment. Ne Nekamaro, catch it. There you go. If you get hurt, let me know. Monomi, you in the back? Get blasted. Uh. Can I begin with a brief introduction of myself? Shut your fake ass up, bro. <laughs> After all this time? You too. Uh, eat it. Uh. What? What was this again? I wasn't listening to a word, bro. Y'all was in here BSing. Oh, well, there's no need to think about it. I wanted descending. Damn. So by not choosing, he let the he let the ops win, basically. <gasps> Excuse All me. Right. A game reset. You guys aren't part of the game, right? No, we are not. You are. You're the only one here part of the game. Get me out of All this right. utopia. We do not this, have nothing to do with this. Goodbye. We're out. Let's go. He said, this world. Who are you? Give me one second. Ooh, look at this scene. Give me one second. Give me one second. I'm just a part of the game. But you guys aren't, right? Chiaki? Is that you? Why are you here? Hmm. I don't know. Does this mean you're my memory of Chiaki? Because you should have already disappeared. Oh well, it doesn't matter. Anyway, don't you think they're messed up? Telling us the world's going to be destroyed and to sacrifice ourselves? There's no way I can choose. For someone like me, I'm just not able to choose. 
Seriously. I've had enough. I'm tired of being mixed up in all this stuff I don't understand. Not only was I told that I have no talent at all, but if I get out, I'll go back to being ultimate despair. And on top of that, I was told I'm going to disappear too. <laughs> Isn't that messed up? Hey, you don't want that either, right? I mean, if we lose our memories, there won't be a single trace of your existence left. You're going to completely disappear, and none of us will ever remember you. No, I won't. Mmm. Huh? Mm. Even if I cease to exist, even if you guys never remember me again, that doesn't mean I will completely disappear. As long as everyone continues to move forward toward the future we created together, I will never disappear. What I lived for, fought for, and risked my life for will still exist. Mm. You're right, but... You're... probably just scared, right? Right, you know that's what it is. Not just of disappearing. You're scared of moving toward the future with such a heavy burden, right? Yeah. I'm scared. I'm obviously terrified of that. How much longer are you going to be this indecisive? Mmm, talk your shit, Yaki. Huh? Didn't you want to become someone with confidence? Isn't that why you admired Hope's Peak Academy? But even Hope's Peak Academy tricked me. Mmm. Hajime, you've had it wrong this whole time. Wrong? Having talent isn't the goal. There's something much more important than whether or not you have talent, right? Please don't say Hope. What's important is that you believe in yourself. Okay, I like that. If you can't do that, no matter how much talent you possess, you will never be confident in yourself. Just like how you were in the past. Mm. You? Hey, who are you? I mean, you should have already disappeared, right? But past Hajime is in the past. Mm. He's not the same Hajime who spent time with me and the others in this world. So it's going to be all right. I think it's time you finally had confidence in yourself. Ichiaki, can you tell me something? Which... Which choice should I make? My hope? The world's hope? Which one should I choose? You guys are the only ones who have the right to decide your future. And the responsibility, too. So you're saying... I should choose for myself? But if you can't choose either future, why don't you just create one? Create? Even if this world is just a game, you guys aren't part of the game. You guys don't have to just choose a future. You should be able to create one as well. Do you think someone like me can do that? Since you're not part of the game, you don't have to worry about talent, skill, or level. You guys have a tremendous ultimate move that can overcome anything. I guess what I'm trying to say is, if you just do it, things will turn out okay. <clears throat> if I do it, things will turn out okay. Of course, games aren't very fun when they're easy to clear. But this isn't a game, right? Hey, Hajime, this isn't for the sake of anyone else. You... You have to do this for yourself. Now then, it's about time you show me your cool side, Hajime. Come on, I'll help out too. Help? I have no talent at all. I have no talent at all. Yeah, I was even betrayed by the academy I admired so much. I don't want to disappear. I don't want these. I'm not Izuru Kamakura. Okay, boom. Who cares what will happen to the world? I'm not. I'm not doing a thing, bro. I have bro. no talent at all. Matter of fact, I was even up. betrayed. But I don't want to disappear. I'm not Izuru. Who cares what? Will I don't want to sacrifice. It's not like I'll be. A There's no way we can. It's the future. Found. Not mine. I can't choose the future. It's just hella excuses. See, if you just do it, things will turn out okay. 
You should even be able to create the future. That sounds beautiful. Create the future. I have no talent at all. I was even betrayed by the academy. I don't want to disappear. Uh, I see what they're doing. I see what they're doing. I see what they're doing. Who I see cares what they're doing. What will happen to the world? They're basically I saying it doesn't matter myself. what doubts, insecurities, trials, tribulations like you may face. Anyway. You are in control of creating the, the future that you want. I see it. There's I get no it. Way we can be Jinko. That's cute. It's the future foundation's fault. That's cute. That's cute. That's cute. Not mine. Even so, I can't choose the future. Even so. See, if you just do it, things will turn out okay. You should even be able to create the future. Didn't I just body everything? I'm not Izuru Kamakura. What? See, if you just do it, things will. Even so, I. Even so, you what? Give me your, give me that, give me a powerful speech. Whoa. No matter what kind of future it is, as long as you guys move toward it, I will never disappear. That's fire. Everything that happened here, it won't be meaningless. That's fire. If you guys carried the burden of both hope and despair, you should even be able to create the future. Mm. Even if it's a convenient miracle, if you just do it, things will turn out okay. If you just do it. That's why you can't hesitate now. Resolve to throw everything away and give it everything you got. I'll be cheering for you, too. That reminds me. I forgot to say it again. Does you love her? Bro. Let me find out you in love. Oh, okay, I got you. I will not even remember. Why everyone died. If we don't rid the Wake world of Wake up, Haji Golly, bro. The tragedy will start once this again. Thing like the, like, this thing like the PS4 controller. I want to at all. Echo one more time. If we turn back into ultimate despair. What is that? Yuck, that looks disgusting. By the future foundation, right? That looks nasty down there, this bro. Yo, put some words on that. You're the ones who fell to despair. Put some words it's on that. What are we talking about? Look at me sleep, though. It's the future foundations. Golly, look at them. Oh, bro. Spike is crazy. Despair. A conclusion will never be fucking Shoot reached. that. Shoot that. Shoot that, bro. Shoot that, bro. You Why does it look hope. like that? Store power. If the memories we made Bro, what disappear. are we talking about? I will not even remember. Bro, I know that's not doing what I think it is. Why everyone died. If we don't rid the world of despair... Bro, something about storm power with this is just not not good gameplay. Do I hold it? They if wanted me to look to at that. Despair. We might be killed by the future foundation, right? This is your I'm so glad this is the last the episode. This is, okay, all right, you bro. You can't lose hope. If the memories we made here, just I will not even remember when everyone died. If we don't rid the world of the tragedy, we'll start with. Bush. Turn back into Bush. Might be killed by the Bush. This is your responsibility. Bush. Excuses. The future foundation. Excuses. Hope and their Excuses. Will never be Excuses. Uh -oh. No, that's wrong. <laughs> Did he just go Super Saiyan with the power of hope? hope? There will probably be a lot of despair too. I don't know what kind of future awaits us. Whoa. But our futures are ours. I won't let anyone take them. That's the thumbnail. That's the thumbnail. Insane, bro. Huh? Who the hell are you? I've decided. I'm done running away. I don't know, bro. He's looking kind of cool in all these little angles, bro. I will fight for my future. I will fight alongside the future that everyone created for me. Akane, like, whoa, who is this? Who is this man next to me? Nakamaro, I'm gonna have to leave you here. It's not for anyone else's sake but my own. Don't tell me. Izuru? Hey, what the heck is going on? I is this a uh, serious bug? That, that or ain't no Izuru. He bodied Izuru in his, in his last logic dive, bro. I am not Izuru Kamakura. Whoa! I am Hajime Hinata. Whoa! 
I just sat here and I talked about how Haji's character was just whack. And he's sitting up here saying, I am not. You despair because you yearn for, you yearn for hope because you Damn! Just for We're playing Sekiro! No for you to choose. Close your eyes and play Ninja Gaiden, bro! If you do that, this game is gonna continue. If you don't want that, just turn off the Golly! game! Golly! Even so, I... You don't have to look at that. I don't hear a word you're saying. I don't hear a word you're saying. I don't hear a word you... Oh, I was supposed to slice that. You don't have to look at the hopeless. Uh, I'll never let anyone choose again. Damn! Okay. I don't want anything. You have no argument. There's no hope. Just give up already. A miracle won't happen. What is this crappy feeling? I don't want anything. Mizuru! It don't matter what, how high the, the no game get. Whenever you gotta do this, this mini game. The future will make you suck. Why? Just give up already. You're not hope. I don't want to lose anything. Any choice is despair. You're not hope. You have no argument. We're not even listening I to you over anything. here. I don't You have no argument. I have no argument. You won't be able to do it. No. You won't be able to do anything. That's wrong. No, that's, that's wrong. The little cameo? Damn, did we fuse it in my brain or something? What the heck is wrong with you? Why is there a bug like this? You're getting bodied. You're getting bodied. Everyone, let's shut this game down. Thank you. Huh? But, but that was actually a whole other hour from when we started the freaking Izu Izuru arc, bro. Don't you get it? If we start the shutdown sequence, we'll. There's never only one choice to make. There's no way I'll allow things to end this way. The future everyone has created for us should have more possibilities than that. Let's leave this place with confidence, and from there we can just create it on our own. The future that we want. Ooh! What are you saying? There's no way something that convenient is going to happen. It wouldn't be strange if a miracle happened. This isn't a game. We can change the future as much as we want. Ah! Even if you talk big, if you leave here, you're just gonna forget everything. Th that goes for everyone else. Um, we just have to press these two buttons Let's at the same go, time. Let's go, Sonya! Correct? <laughs> um, I wonder. I do not really understand it myself, but I just, I just saw it. What'd you see? Talk about it. Talk about it. When my body felt so heavy that I could not move, when I felt as though I was sinking into a deep black sea. Damn! It was at that moment, I somehow heard Hajime's voice. And though it was just a flash, I saw it. She was inspired! Like a lighthouse beacon shining across an ocean of darkness. A warm... Yet resolute light. The one who shined that light. It was probably. You saw it too, right, Hajime? The future we are going to create from this moment on. It is also the future that everyone has created, right? Then, there is no way we can stop now. Oh, yeah. Seriously? That's a suicidal decision! They said, they said they're ready for this. I'm well aware it might be an act of suicide. There's no telling how this will play out, but... I... I heard her voice. In fact, I think it was the first time she ever yelled at me. Damn! Bro, everybody is... I can't stand on my own two feet if she keeps treating me like a damn kid. I don't like thinking about complicated stuff. If there's someone strong worth fighting, I'll fight. It's just who I am, you know? That's what it means to be confident, right? Then, I'm gonna choose this! Man, this sure is getting annoying again. But if you're saying you're gonna do it, there's no way I can back out now. If I don't have any place to go back to, I should at least protect this place no matter what. 
You... you all... Why? Why? How... how can you guys throw yourselves back into the depths of despair? Because we believe. Mm. Huh? We believe in our future. That's what makes us different from you. Mm. We believe that if we try new things, even difficult things, that everything will turn out okay. Mm. We believe we can even create our own futures. Mm. That's... that's impossible! That can't be hope! It's not even despair! What is this?! Hajime, everyone, thank you. Wow. I'm not the one you should be thanking. Mmm. Huh? Mmm, I'm liking that theme though. I'm liking that theme of paying it forward. Chiaki inspired Hajime when he was at his lowest. Everybody else was at their lowest. Hajime inspired the whole group. Golly, the power of hope, bro. Damn! Damn! Give me an A, though. Give me an A, bro. Please give me an A. I haven't gotten an A this entire game. Please. What did I get wrong? get started I didn't think it would end this easily huh it's not the end right this is just the beginning right first we need to let this game world end and from that point on we are the ones who are going to create Wow they chose to stay bro they just said, let's blow this world up and create a new future with just us. No matter what, what may happen. Okay. Is that a stun move? Oh, oh, she's trapping her there. Your body, uh, parry, down, down air. Ooh, tether grab to a forward throw. Damn! Oh, they was playing a stamina. That was that was stamina mode. Golly! Why did Spike? You're not slick, Spike. I saw what you did right there, bro. Does that mean Monokuma's gone forever? Bro, Monokuma just died? <laughs> Man, this is absolute despair. I feel despair upon despair and despair toward despair yet again. How fun. Once you've experienced the despair I've suffered, <laughs> there's no turning back. Living in the shadows of past memories. That's too sad, you know? But I guess I no longer, I no longer have to hope for despair. That is just so hopeless. What was Ooh, that? Ooh, this just is a hard ass picture right here. Sami appear. She should have already disappeared. Yo, all my artists, I need y'all to draw me in the mix with this one. This is fire, please. I guess it's just as Hajime said. At least this wasn't the ending prepared for them. This was the ending they created. Are you saying they're moving towards such an uncertain future on purpose? Even so. The only thing we can do now is leave it to them. This game world is going to end soon. There is nothing more we can do. Regardless, there's no need for us to do anything. Wow. Man, it's collapsing. You're right. 
Yo, Haji, are you using Nen, bro? You're the only one that got Nen activated. None of us know that, that technique yet, bro. Um, I am sorry to trouble everyone, but even if we awaken in the real world and forget about what transpired here, it will still have meaning, right? Of course, Miss Sonia. I don't know the proper way to say this, but I, I kind of feel the same way, too. You're so bad at explaining things. Now that it's the end, you should at least try a little harder. People can't change that easily, you know. Well, whether it has meaning or not, it all depends on us now. Time's almost up. I'm pretty scared. I am scared, too. But it's okay, right? It makes sense to feel scared, right? That's the future! Hey, I'll never forget you guys. Or the others. You guys better remember me too. My name is Kazuichi Soda. <laughs> With your colorful personalities, there's no way I'd forget you guys that easily. Even if I forget, I will use all my might and remember. If you start talking weird later, Hajime, I'll beat you up till you turn back to normal. That's a relief. But make sure you hold back as much as you can. <laughs> Wow. So this is the end. But it's just the beginning. Isn't that right? It doesn't change how scared I am. I can't help feeling scared. So scared, but... Thank you. Thank you, Chiaki. Phew. I finally said it. Thank you. Okay. 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 Respect. And Dominic fell in love with it with an O and one. I'm like, bro, you know she's not real, right? That's like a Tamagotchi. Speaking of, Me I never too. got to see my dog hat! Thank I mean my, my, my thing hatch! I'll never forget about you guys. I'll never ever forget. My egg is sitting up in my pocket, bro. I'll be cheering for you guys from now on. From somewhere. All I- Can I still check? Are you serious? Yo, this game blows, bro. Cuz... We're all friends after all. What's with that ominous music? That ominous ass music. What is that, bro? Can you back the picture up? Oh, okay. No, we're done. And so, the incident is coming to an end. The incident riddled with absurdity, with nonsense, with sheer irrationality. It's about to lower its curtain. An incident smaller than Host Peak Academy's biggest, most tragic event. Smaller than the biggest, most awful, most tragic event in human history. An incident so small, it doesn't even have a name. The world will never know what happened here. Not now, not in the distant future. As long as they remain here. Apparently they've finished the preparations. We can leave any time. Then, I guess we should get going. Hey, Makoto. Is this really okay? You're the one who said, leave the questions to me. So I let you take the lead. Are they really going to be okay? Didn't they just turn back into ultimate despair? I don't think that's the case. I mean, if they did turn back, they wouldn't have said that they'd stay on this island. Perhaps they're thinking about helping their sleeping friends? I can't really say for sure, but that's what I believe. Whether they know it or not, the fact that they're already clinging to that feeling shows they're no longer who they were in the past. It seems that there are too many soft-hearted people here. But in reality, the possibility of those who are asleep waking up is close to zero. 
no the possibility damn that's happening. a hard picture too scrap that last one scrap that last one can y'all squeeze me in here somehow please bro even if there's the smallest possibility they're still trying to create that future for themselves in their eyes that is the future mm, i like that though i like that the smallest possibility you might as well call it a miracle strangely enough i have a feeling that they'll be able to reach it they've accepted their hopes and their despair and they're trying to create their own future maybe for people like that miracles are inevitable don't you think <laughs> as cheesy as ever seriously you haven't grown up at all <laughs> haven't grown up that's the main reason we decided to come with you well who cares I guess I'll respect your decision this time. However, what comes next is going to be difficult for us. Leaving them on this island. If the higher-ups at HQ find out about this, it will definitely cause a scene. We need to work on concealing it. I got questions, bro. That's not a problem. And what do you intend to explain to HQ? Uh, um, about that. I was gonna think about it while I was on the ship. HQ must be talking about future foundation with, with like good luck. Y'all got I'm not going to help you that much. Y'all got bosses? Huh? Why? You should at least be glad that we decided to respect your decision. Fine. We're gonna have to watch this whole scene back because I got way too many questions. This is a hard picture too. God no 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 that previous one. That then previous let's one. Let's go back as well. We're not even close to finished yet. There's still a lot we must do. Besides the Future Foundation, the biggest, most awful, most tragic event in human history is not finished. We must end this once and for all, for the sake of the future. It seems I must fight alongside you all for a little while longer. Plus, there's someone waiting for you to return. Don't make me remember something so horrifying. Then let's go. We must create our own futures too. Bro. And so, the ordeal has ended. And from here, our daily lives have started. Lives that are much more absurd, nonsensical, and irrational than before. Things are probably going to be a lot more difficult now. There's no such thing as an answered mystery. It's doubtful whether or not things will even end well. The future isn't a path. It's like an endless sea. Bro, I thought the island got exploded. Right? Because how are they at the island if this island was supposed to be a virtual... Like, you know what I mean? There was bodies in tombs around a big-ass computer. And if you died in the virtual world, you essentially died in real life. You were brain dead in real life. So why are they acting like they're hopping on a boat, leaving a literal island if we saw them teleport out of the last trial? And who is talking? You can try to go anywhere, but it doesn't mean you'll get there. That's definitely Haji. How are you still talking to me? Even so, I will keep on living. What? I will keep on living as Hajime Hinata. Wait, so that is, that is Iz Izuru! That is Izuru! My future lies here. Is that it? That's Izuru and he, and, and he... Wait a minute! Does that mean that he was able to create a future as in keep his memory from inside the game and he survived? Then where's everybody else? Hey! Hey! Come back! Y'all gotta explain this one, bro. Y'all gotta explain this one. Y'all gotta explain this one, bro. Uh-uh, 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 uh-uh. Uh-uh, uh-uh. What are those, bro? Easter egg. Monomy, okay, sure. What is that, a Bible, a book? Dang and rump of, what if? I'm cool. No, bro, I'm done. I'm done. Island mode.
No, no, sir. 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 Wow. I'm. Uh, yo. Y'all gotta explain the ending to me, bro. I could have sworn I was on point, but then they started throwing me off. Monokuma, we don't even care anymore. Like, you're gone. You're done. Finito. Man down. Man down. That is the ending of Danganronpa 2. Goodbye, despair, ladies and gentlemen. I hope that you all enjoyed this playthrough. Took us probably just as long to beat the first game. Not even gonna lie to you. Probably took us just as long. Before I can really say if I like the game or not, I like the game. I like the game. But before I can really, like, be like, oh, yeah, this is it. Y'all gotta explain the ending for me, bro. I'm not even gonna hold you up any longer because it's already definitely over, way over two hours. If you enjoyed this series, make sure you slap a like on this video. Subscribe if you are new. I love y'all, bro, and I'll see you in the next video. Peace. Please explain it for me, bro. Please.